This experiment was about the carbon to nitrogen ratio and how it affects the decomposing rate of compost. Compost needs certain requirements to decompose, such as water, sun, carbon, nitrogen, and aeration time. There are various important terms to know while conducting this experiment, such as C down ratio, which is the carbon to nitrogen ratio of the mass of carbon to the mass of nitrogen in a substance. Another three terms to know is decompose, organic, and compost. Here is a table of what and what not to put in compost. For example, you can put in organic fruit and vegetable scraps, but not put in dairy. There are many do's and do nots about what to put in compost. Compost helps with various environmental problems such as lessening the need for CO2 in the environment and atmosphere, improving plant growth, reducing food waste, and more. The problem for this experiment is how does the carbon to nitrogen ratio affect the decomposing rate of compost? My hypothesis was that if there is 25 to 30 parts carbon to one part nitrogen, it will result in a faster decomposed compost than other ratios. My reasoning for this is because many people say that more carbon than nitrogen will decompose while using both carbon and nitrogen and not just one of the both. These are the variables that I used throughout my experiment. These are the materials that I used to conduct my experiment. In this experiment, I had six bags, all filled with different C-down ratios. Bag 1 was 0 to 0, and it was the control. Bag 2 was 2 to 0, bag 3 was 0 to 2, bag 4 is 2 to 1, bag 5 was 1 to 1, and bag 6 was 1 to 2. Six of these bags go in the sun, and six go in the dark. This is the setup that I used to set up all of my bags. For my procedure, I filled all my bags with a certain C-down ratio. I put 180 milliliters of water and 360 milliliters of soil in each. I took the temperature for 16 days and recorded my findings in a notebook. These are some average graphs for the compost temperatures. Therefore, my conclusion corresponds with the hypothesis. Bag 4 decomposed the quickest. Bag 5 had a more wanted texture, though. Bag 6 grew mold. Bag 3 was extremely soupy. Bag 2 didn't decompose. Bag 1, also the control, stayed the same. Knowing the C-down ratio helps make the perfect compost pile for growing plants and food. Compost helps people know where their food comes from, it minimizes fossil fuels, and it reduces landfill waste, pollution, and much more.